The objective at Kettering Football Pitches was to improve the existing conventional drainage system which had previously been installed at 20 metre centres and was struggling to cope in this heavy clay subsoil. This aerial footage shows where our EGRP system has been retrofitted in between each of the existing 20 metre centres, increasing the specification from 20 metres to 10 metre centres. Before starting on site, a container is delivered. This enables us to store machinery, materials and equipment safely. At the start and end of each shift, our equipment is safely stored away, which helps us meet the responsibilities of our health and safety plan. Our first job on site is to mark out the pitch according to the design drawing. Before any drilling takes place, we use a string line and a spray can to mark out the positions and depths of each of the boreholes. Here you see the diamond pattern, which is our standard design for sports turf drainage. A golf hole cutter is used to remove cores of turf before each of the boreholes are drilled. These cores are set to one side, and after the holes have been drilled and the devices installed, are later used to dress the holes. At no point does the drill rig ever make direct contact with the playing surface. Track mats are used to both spread the weight, avoiding compaction, and to prevent any physical damage to the pitch surface. Each drill rig has two operatives, a machine driver and an attendant to change the augers, remove the spoil, and insert the EGRP devices. The majority of boreholes drilled on site are either 1.5 or 3 metres deep. However, deeper boreholes are drilled to 6 and 12 metres in order to access lower, unsaturated strata of soil. In our standard sports pitch design, the deepest borehole we drill is 12 metres deep. Here you can see a 12 metre EGRP device being installed into the borehole. Once installed, the head of the EGRP device is set to 300 millimetres below ground level. Once the holes have been backfilled using a free draining root zone and the replacement of the original core, the pitch is then ready to hand back over for use. Typically, we will have finished work around about 5.30 and be ready to hand the pitch back to the club by 6 p.m. In many instances, clubs are back on the pitch using it for training in the evening any time from 6.30 onwards. Our final task on site is to record the location of each of the boreholes using a GPS device. This information is then used to produce an as-built drawing which is sent to the client for their records.